Hello, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. It's time for some more uh, Hearts of Iron 3, where I'm just apparently missing stuff. Which is really strange. I found this guy here, who's short to artillery. I have a spare artillery here, but these guys are already set up in groups of three with a set of dudes waiting. Uh, I also should probably ditch these light tanks. I don't need them. We're going mechanized. Alright. More fishing laws can be enacted. Yeah, I know. I've just been sort of waiting until it would be about time for World War II to start. <clears throat> and I'm currently organizing things. Alright. So, ooh, give a letter. Okay. Soviet Union disorganized, thankfully. But they're going to be a problem, and I need to start acting realistically. I'm never going to fill the whole thing with uh, double fun, double wide. Um, but it's within reason that I can pull a single wide, I think. Especially if I, you know, get some dudes over here. What? 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 All right. Um. Okay. And over here. We need to dice things up around here. Alright. Toss these two together. Go. And these two together. Four and one. Oh, there's apparently one too many here. Well, that's convenient considering I'm short artillery here. That's perfect. Alright. Okay, the one artillery that I am short here, go there. Danzig or war, last chance for peace. And unsurprisingly, war were declared. Everyone's mobilizing, Germany's adopted the Blitzkrieg. Alright, <clears throat> you two will be the last line reinforcement we got there. See, we're getting pretty far here. We're getting along up here, alright. I mean, at this point, it's obvious to just withdraw the rest of my soldiers over here. That way they don't have to walk so far. We're not going to war with Germany. As much as I like to. We are not. And I still have a pile of dudes. God knows what else. Alright. So. We have a lot of extra IC now that our upgrades seem to be done for the time being. So, 28. No, 27. Yeah, 27. This will be another massive batch of artillery and probably, I think, the last one. Right now, I'm still trying to get myself organized here. It's, uh, kind of awkward. Okay. I've dropped... I, I dropped research earlier, actually. A lot of it, anyway. That wasn't critical. <laughs> Uh, to try and get more officers, that's why I've managed to make it as high as I did. I, I'm playing a fine balancing game here, I find. Can't overdo it on anything. Immediately, now we must start researching mechanized infantry. Which, of course, it will tell me is inefficient, but I don't really care. 1942, it'll, it'll actually be much sooner than this. Uh, I'm not too concerned about that. Good, good. Hopefully that, uh, thing's done soon so we can toss, uh, something else on the electronic computing machine. Good. Germany is no longer attempting to influence us. Everyone is mobilizing. No surprise. And... Boom. Boom. All right, so now I know where my Soviet border is, at least. But I don't have long now. All right, so is this all uh, organized up? Just about. Whoops. 
Um. And I thought I yeah, I thought the second artillery one was the HQ one. Alright, check organized. Check organized. And we're just gonna get rid of you. You are not necessary. You guys apparently have people still attached to the hierarchy, so we'll get rid of you. get rid of that. Hey, you're short a bit. Yeah, you are. Uh oh. Noted, you're short a dude. Uh, I will put an extra... Friggin... Artillery on the production line, then. Okay. You guys form up. Good, you guys are probably... Tenth corpse already. Ninth corpse is set. Perfect. So, we have our first proper entire army now. Create a higher command. Did I just... Damn it. Alright, so now all of these guys are attached to the third army. Uh, we're gonna need to fix that. Whoops. Right, the game's a little dumb sometimes. You'd think it would uh, attach the corpse before it attached the uh, divisions, but oh well. What you gonna do, right? Uh, now the problem is figuring out who's attached and who's not. I have to go through pretty much all the piles. Okay. Attach the third corpse. Okay. to the tenth corpse. Tenth corpse. Yep. 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 Okay. So now each corpse has five divisions under it. Perfect. Okay. Of which all of these will now attach to the third army. Boom. I have a full army. Can you believe that? I have no idea what the hell you just attached to. I don't know why. Let's try that again. There we are. We now have the third army holding a line here. There. It's it's half filled. It's about the best I could hope for, really. Um, it unfortunately is. Uh, I went with a uh, design that basically is super heavy on the industry, without enough industry to properly support it. It's okay, I'm pretty certain I'll be fine. Apparently descent change increase is fine. Yeah, sure, Cuba, you can buy some supplies from me. Alright. So... Let's uh, start spreading out infantry all over the place here. Apparently running out of supplies there, not good. Probably something to do with the sheer number of dudes I have here. Hang on, there's a spare artillery in here. That's fine then. And they were short anyway. That's alright. I'm not too concerned about it. Where the hell is the spare artillery? I'm looking for the one that is suspiciously 10,000, maybe? Or 7,000, yep. Yeah. The one that was not a multiple of three in thousands. <laughs> and don't really care that mechanized infantry is technically inefficient. <clears throat> like, just at how powerful it is, considering I have fully up to date. Uh, stuff here is ridiculous. Uh, let's see, so soft attack plus 2. And soft attack plus 2.4. So we're looking at a soft attack keep uh, on par with our artillery, which is up to like 5 something now, I think. Let's double check. It's fully upgraded. And it has a soft attack of 5.4. There we are. That's what I like to see better my artillery. 
Okay. Wow, movement takes forever with these mountains. Okay, you do that. Okay, you're organized up. There, now this army is, I think, complete. All right, so we'll drop three on you. Good. We're gonna be ready for the Soviet attack. Peace on the Maginot Line. Denmark's fallen. Amel's been seceded. All right. And we're gonna need one, two. All right, and separate. One, two, one, two. Boom. Oh yeah, as I do this, I should probably disconnect them from the current command structure we have. Because it's being pretty much replaced by a built-from-the-ground-up command structure. Mm. Homemade. Best kind of command structure. How many are we sitting on? Six? Okay. That I can do. Oh, that's enough for another province, actually. Um, with 15 artillery per province, we're only going to get... We're not actually going to make it to the hills and mountains like I was hoping. See, all these areas that I picked... Uh, I don't know. I guess we can run another... We can run another set. Problem is we're running out of time. June 1940 is when we are cooked. It's just over three months for a production run, so that's something, I guess. I understand that we aren't going to have mechanized infantry by then. Um, okay, what did we just research? <laughs> I don't even know. I'm not able to keep track of my research. Artillery barrel and ammunitions. An invite to the faction. Well, I'm already supplying Germany with oil, then, automatically. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to decline. I, I don't see a need. It, maybe. I might. I might. At some point. Some point down the line. It, it is within reason that I could see myself joining the Axis. But... First things first, I want to damn well make sure I am capable of fighting off the Soviets if it comes to it. Two, three, one, two, three. Actually, move one over there. Slovakia has been accepted into the Axis. Tactical command structure, and we can now research... You guessed it. Alright, so our artillery and tactical command structure is now ahead. Good. Tactical command structure will be replaced with superior firepower, which will just simply allow me to put even more. Jeez. Whew. Even more artillery. This will go up from, I would like to remind everyone, 15 artillery per set of, per, per corpse to 20. All right. Yeah, superior firepower is fine, and... Okay, that production run's more or less done. Run it. Just run more artillery. Whenever uh, we get mechanized, I'll stop building artillery. Alright, just... Get them together or something. I don't know. It's... Alright, I guess we'll do that. Yeah, no. Alright, artillery card. Alright, so that's another inefficient research. We are going to t ditch that one. Because there's no reason to be researching that. <clears throat> the question is, what do we replace it with? We still don't have an improvement to mechanical computing machines, like I was hoping. Uh... 
I suppose industrial efficiency. Yeah, that's a good thing to do. I'm going to take it light tank guns now. Yep. Start researching that, I guess. Just research whatever the hell we can at this point. We're short on officers. And I'm not personally too picky at this point. Alright. So, one, two, three. I'm just thinking, like, should I just manufacture up a bunch? Eh. I have no idea. I'm, like, trying to get this many things organized at once is surprisingly hard. Three, one, two, 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 three. All right. I would say we have this fairly well uh, ready. This rate, we're gonna have a second army. Oof! I wasn't expecting a second army. All right. Good. You're ready. Okay, come on. There we are. And you there. And now, you... Here. I'm going to move you there, because we're going to start putting actual dudes there. Again, I'm just... Like I said, I'm not really willing to join the Axis powers yet. Maybe soon. Maybe soon. But, uh, yeah, All right, I'll give him a little money for it. Get some rare materials. At least a few in there. We're running a bit low. Actually, no, we have an abundance of everything. We have an abundance of iron, actually. We'd want to see 30,000, uh, 20,000, 10,000, roughly. So, not necessarily a shortage, but yeah. So, how long are we out of, uh, out for superior firepower right now? August 3rd, that'll be too late. Mechanized infantry, now it's 1941, but that'll of course be too late. I, I expected that to be too late. So those guys are propered. Okay. These five here. These two here. No, uh, these two here. Okay. Well, we almost have the Soviet border garrisoned. Like, ooh, yes. So, industry. We now have the electronic computing machine. I can't cut officers, though. Apparently I can cut mechanical computing machine, though. In favor of electronic. Infantry support weaponry. That's fine to cut. And we'll be cutting small arms in a moment. Okay. Good. Focus on officers. We're going to need every freaking officer we can get at this point. Like, we're getting attacked in June. We get attacked in June. Freaking June. This region, I'm not probably not going to manage to make the garrisons, so that's fine. That's the reason I'm doing these regions last, because they're mountains and hills. Alright, we have 15 there. <clears throat> We have six here, seven, eight, 
Nine. Nine here, so we need six more. Then we need 15. Then, yeah, all right. We will actually just barely make our deadline, I think, for getting all this shit done. Yeah, March is... God, I love how fast I can manufacture artillery after uh, th that mess. All right. Unfortunately, hooking this all into the divisional and army structure is going to be impossible. All right. <laughs> so we got the first army there, the second army in the north. And we're just going to have our ragtag whatever is trying to hold these mountain provinces. I mean, they I'm thinking we'll be okay. Like, yeah. I think we'll be okay. Not going to lie, though. The Soviets seem to have a lot of dudes. However, the Finnish Winter War hasn't happened yet. I have that advantage for me. Um, the, so the Soviets have a giant deficit to their officer corps. Apparently, no, the Winter War is happening right now. Shit. I was going to say, there might be a chance. Ooh, wow, Finland's winning. Go Finland. And that's actually somewhat historical. It, I was like, hang on, what, what, what year does the Winter War happen in? Because I know it's 40, but I forget, is it like uh, the first Winter of 40 or the second Winter of 40? Oh, dear. Yeah, that's all right. So the Winter War is happening, which could be a problem. I'm keeping this on the table, um, just for now. If I, for even a remote second in May or June, think I can't beat the Soviets, I will walk away and just go with Germany. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking I can pull this. And it's going to be one sad Soviet Union. All right. Okay, so we got three there. I think I should probably just start dissolving uh, anything that isn't like the HQ or anything. Is there something hooked here? Right, I see. I take it that means there is somebody... Yep. There we go. Alright, I think we're set up then with that. Good. Good. Third army is ready. Christ. Get ready to defend ourselves. This is a lot of artillery. And unfortunately only half as many infantry as I was hoping. And, well, half as many artillery as I was hoping as well. We'll see, though. We shall see. We have a lot going for us, but for now, I'm going to end today's episode here. So without further ado, thank you everybody for watching. As always, this has been your lovely host, Galvin, signing off.